Hey, welcome back to Cover That Rib. Okay, so we got the deck all sloped, and now we've got it sheeted with the plywood, which is great. So now we want to go chuck all the lines where the joist boards are, or the rafter boards, and then we want to start nailing it off. So that's what we're doing. So let's check it out. Uh, he's coming back right here and hitting the nails that didn't go all the way down. So we're just re-tapping those. Okay, so you get the gist. You always gotta set the air compressor right so the pound per pressure is perfect so the nails will go down flush. That's usually at about 120 pounds is where you need to set your compressor out. So we're gonna have to go adjust that right now so the nails will go down flush. But we're coming back with a hammer and hitting the head down so it goes down flush so we're okay. So once we're done with that, then we get to put our peel and stick base down. That's this stuff right here. This roll of paper right here is peel and stick. So, we're gonna get the rest of the roof all sheeted over with the nails, and then we'll, we're gonna jump to something else, and we'll get back when we start doing the peel and stick so you can see how it's done, okay? So we'll see you in a bit. Hey, welcome back to Cover That Roof. Okay, so now that we got all of the roof all sheeted, all nailed off, we've passed all of our inspections, everything's great. Now we gotta put on the peel and stick, which is the first layer. As you can tell by the weather, it's just getting ready to rain, so we barely beat the rain, which is great. Okay, so now we're gonna put this on, but we gotta do one last little test to see This is called the golf ball roll. Wait, get it. Get it, get it, get it. Get it. All right, so let's try this one more time. Okay, so we want to see the slope of the roof. Put the golf ball down. And look, it rolls by itself. It rolls by itself. Oh, yes. Get it before it falls off and breaks something. Okay, so we're stoked. All right, perfect. Now we can start doing the peel and stick, so let's do it. So we want to pin this in, get one foot down in the corner. Just like that. Now we want to walk down the seam. Oh, it's too easy. It's too easy. Okay, so now we just want to keep doing that until we're done. Okay, so now we just want to keep spreading that till we're done. So, just take it layer by layer. See, look at that. Roll by roll. Layer by layer. So we just want to keep repeating the same process. Want to roll it out? So he's going to roll it out. We want to hang it over a little bit over because we still have to hang the fascia board. But we're under the gun right now for time so we want to make sure we get the deck waterproof. It's supposed to rain tonight. Most important thing, come back hang the fascia later. So we're hanging that over just a little bit. So that will stick to it. So everything's working pretty good. Down that a little bit of nails. Get it all lined up. 
So we want to get it lined up. We got on the four inch line. Once again, just peel it up. Just like this. Pull it up all the way across. Once again, we want to get it all the way on this side. This stuff is very slippery too, so we're lucky that it's not a real big steep slope. We set this for about three quarters of an inch of a pitch. We don't want to make it too much because people still have to walk up here after we're done. We still have to put a couple more layers of the torch down. Then they're going to go back with a decorative tile on top, which is going to look pretty awesome. So this is where we're at right now. Just want to keep, keep moving, keep moving. We're going to get this done in a second. We're going to get back to you when we're all done. So we're going to jump to something else. We'll see you soon. For you yesterday. Okay, so you can see, got it all papered up with a peel and stick. Got this wall specially protected. Got all the walls nicely wrapped. Got this corner over here wrapped. Got the little sides done. Everything's looking great. So as a precautionary, we got to put this tarp down on top of the peel and stick paper. It's supposed to rain. We don't want any dirt or trash getting on the peel and stick because we still got a torch to this with a hot, with a uh, blowtorch. So we want this to be as clean as possible. Okay. And then this area right here, we're gonna cover that going across too as well. So let's do it. 